Chi chi? E chi chi a te mi? Tu so mi? Chi chi? Vieni, vieni, c'è tutto il porai, vieni, chi chi? Vieni, vieni, vieni. Mira di un chi chi? Chi chi? Chi chi, io resto chi? Eh, chi vieni, 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 chi chi? Dai, ok, ok, chi chi? Chi chi, ven, 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 ven. Chi chi, ven, ven, ven. Chi chi. Chi chi, chi chi, chi chi chi. Ven, 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 chi chi, ven, 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 ven. Chi chi, ebe, atento, 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 ven, chi chi. Ven, chi chi, chi chi, chi chi, chi chi. E mira di un chi che ho te in me, tu ti avrai un calo con un po' di occhi, eh? He calls his pig Kiki. And as Kiki's grown older, he's become troublesome. Gaston should have gotten rid of him a long time ago. The animal would have made good ham. Very good ham, in fact. But Gaston couldn't. He doesn't know why, he just couldn't, that's all. Gaston's been raising pigs since he was 12. Marceline was the one who showed him how. Marceline was his grandmother. Since then, Gaston has had one or two litters a year. He raises them, then sells them. Except for Kiki. He keeps Kiki for himself. They spend every winter together in the woods looking for truffles, for black truffles. They're a very rare species of mushroom that grow underground. No one can ever say for sure where truffles grow. The only way to find them is to smell them out. Pigs instinctively love the smell of truffles. But it's not only the smell they like. Given half a chance, they'd swallow them down in no time. But when he finds one, it's not his to eat, and that irritates him. He gets a reward right away, though, and that makes it easier on him. have pigs who cheat. They'll excavate a whole area for only an acorn or an earthworm. At least Kiki's fair play as far as that goes. When he sets out to work, you can be sure there are truffles around. Bravo, Kiki. Lo más trubado. But for a pig to smell a ripe truffle 20 meters away, that's very rare. So it's not so hard understanding why Gaston wouldn't like to part with his sidekick. Yet that's exactly what he should have done. For centuries, everyone in the region hunts for truffles, both men and women. Moth is Gaston's neighbor. She's always impressed him ever since they were kids. 
Senti se mulo tu fuoto, eh? Ata che sfato. Mmm. Eh. Sen ingero, sen, sen. Mmm, tu la plazo come gone fuori in pompa nevat. Oh, non pa con memo. Eh, bene, va bene. Martha's land is adjacent to Gaston's, but her truffles are always tastier, and that's always bothered Gaston. Mm. What's more, she knows how to cook them. He's not the only one in the area who loves to sit down to one of her meals. Hey, Truffles are really an event. The texture, the fragrance, the flavor. It's pure magic. Martha's pig is a four-month-old female, and of course she comes from Gaston's farm. Marjorie is Gaston's granddaughter. She comes over for school holidays, and Gaston always manages to have a new litter of piglets for her arrival. A sow gives birth in three months, three weeks, and three days. When the babies are born, each chooses a nipple and never changes again. Stubborn animals, pigs, right from the start. They are put to work at three months old. They hunt for truffles until they're one. Any older, they get too big and strong, so they have to be replaced. Kiki's now two years old, and he already weighs 450 pounds. Kiki has smelled out hundreds of truffles without being allowed to eat any. So one day he set out to do his own truffle hunting. No one knows for sure when he started slipping out at night. But that night Gaston was already sound asleep. In the end, Marjorie kept it to herself, so Gaston was never able to figure it out. On Tuesdays, people from all around gather at the truffle market. Gaston sells his pigs. These here are well trained. They're ready for truffle hunting. Poisset is Gaston's oldest friend. He owns several acres of truffle-rich land. Land with a lot of oak trees all around. But no one could go in. Since he lives purely on the sales of his truffles, he protects them. People choose their animal. As a general rule, one that's a food lover but not too much of a cheater. 
It's easy to see a good eater, but harder to spot a cheater. You've got to have a good eye. Truffles are exported to the entire world. They're sold to the great restaurants and to any other food lover. For a mushroom, obviously, it's pretty expensive. In fact, very expensive. But connoisseurs are ready to shell out a lot of money. And with Martha, they have to. She's a very good businesswoman. In fact, she handles Gaston's truffles, too. <laughs> Market day is holiday time for Kiki, and he usually pays a visit to his girlfriend. The problem with truffles is their high cost. Current prices as they are, some people are unscrupulous. They sneak into your truffle patch at night and steal what they can find. The other problem is Gaston's pig and his bad habits. Kiki came back early the next morning, exhausted and sick. Too many truffles is not recommended. No wonder Kiki wasn't in very good shape and had no desire to go truffling. At first, Gaston didn't suspect anything. But then, Boisset's truffle grounds were ransacked, and the story started getting complicated. Gaston wasn't very surprised. The country is full of truffle poachers, but they never get caught. <laughs> On the other hand, Kiki must have felt guilty. No one can tell what a pig is thinking, but this time he was truly afraid, that's for sure. And that marked the end. Kiki was not to write out of whack, and there was nothing else to get from him. Gaston didn't understand what had happened to his pig. It lasted for several days. Gaston tried everything, but Kiki didn't want to know about it. He was not up to truffling anymore. Gaston thought his pig might be ill. 
But no, he just wanted to sleep, that's all. And Gaston got used to the idea that he would have to replace his pig. He chose one of his sucklings with a healthy appetite. He would call him Kiki like all the ones who'd come before. It takes a few weeks to train a pig. He's got to concentrate on the truffle scent and get used to walking alongside someone. What takes even longer is to learn to understand each other. And that's why Gaston was still secretly hoping that things would work out with the elder Kiki. But in the meantime, Kiki had resumed his piggish escapades. And one morning, he didn't return home. Gaston was worried. Imagine someone swiping his kiki. What else could it be? Animals don't usually go off on their own. At last, Gaston understood. His pig had dug holes and right in the middle of his old friend's truffle patch. He had to find Kiki and fast. His Kiki had been stuffing his face for weeks on Boisset's truffles. And now look at the state he's in. Oh, Kiki, then, then, then. Kiki, then, man, man, Kiki, then, then, Kiki, then, 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 Kiki, then, then. First of all, he had to repair the result of Kiki's antics. He went to his stock of truffles. Oh, Peter di Kiki. Ah, mi lo dico che lo cosa fa fa lui Kiki, me non ve fatto facis. E non ve fa de trau proces. A che il cum con me mo. Burying truffles like this is disheartening. Martha. Gaston thinks Martha could cheer him up. So he told her everything. <laughs>
Huase, in fact, did go back over his truffle ground with his pig, and obviously it didn't take much to fill his basket with fine truffles. Gaston's truffles. Well, the damage had to be fixed. On the other hand, there was someone who understood nothing whatsoever. In the end, the whole farce had cost Gaston a lot of money. Everything that Kiki had harvested. And naturally, everyone wound up hearing the story. But out of politeness, no one said anything about it to Gaston. They didn't even want to tease him. A few oak trees have to be planted every year because no one knows how truffles germinate. But everyone knows they like the roots of oak trees. New truffles begin to grow by the end of March, and they are ripe by the following December. Gaston's been planting trees for truffling for the past 50 years. Because oak trees need to be at least 20 years old to help truffles grow, sometimes more. These trees he's planting for his kids. They're the ones who'll come truffling next. Everyone in the countryside wanted him to get rid of his pig. It's for your own good, they said, for your health. In truth, more than a few of them had their minds on the ham it would make. But the pig must have gotten wind of the plot, because old Kiki became normal again, almost gentle, almost. So Gaston convinced himself that he could keep him a little while longer. And anyone who doesn't agree, well, it's none of their business. Because Gaston is one hell of a guy, and Kiki is one hell of a pig.